Hello everyone, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. I hope everyone is well. It's Friday. It's time for the weekend top and bottom of the deck reading. For those of you who are new here and don't know how we do this, I go by the elements. So it's cancer season, they're a water element. Sorry, water sign. So start with water, go around the wheel accordingly. Just like a general zodiac sign reading. If it resonates, it resonates. If it don't, it don't. Stay through to the end, check your moon, rising, your Venus sign element. It might resonate a little bit better, it might not. I don't know. I'm not walking your path, it's hard for me to say. I just read cards, guys. Time and energy are both fluid, all things can and maybe vice versa. Cross watches are always welcome, and without further ado, let's throw down some cards for the weekend. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, what's going on with you guys? Possible return, maybe you're doing it, maybe the other person's doing it. Possible communication coming in. Possibly of a bit of a fiery nature. Could be, doesn't necessarily have to be. Fiery as in sugar and spice, a little something, something. Maybe that's what I'm seeing just off the top of my head. And either way. It's someone you potentially may have already been dealing with. So, beware, it is Mercury Retrograde. Still, I'm sorry. <laughs> Returns are gonna be happening. <laughs> they may be welcome, they may not. It's hard to say, again, I'm not walking your path. Oh, for crying out loud. Sorry, my assistant started going off. Okay. In the past, we have the world and the king of swords. Okay, well, there was the end of a cycle. Okay. <laughs> Possibly due to someone making a non-emotional decision, but a logical one. Thinking with your head, not your heart. May have ended abruptly. I don't know. Hard to say. We'll throw a clarifier on it. What happened next? Oh, High Priestess reversed, Four of Pentacles reversed. Oh boy. Unacknowledged connection, possibly someone who's trying to ignore the connection, but still, I don't know, just trying to release some feelings. Trying to forget about it, just letting it go connection was still there. Someone's ego may have been a little bit wounded. All right, what's happening this weekend? Ha, 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 ha. I don't think you're doing a darn thing about this return. I have an ace of cups reversed and a page of cups reversed. Yeah, no, you're just like, you know what? Um, no, I don't think so. <laughs> We're not going to, no. <laughs> We're not getting anything started. I'm not even going to acknowledge you. No. <laughs> it's your journey, not mine. You might, you might not. I don't see you doing anything about it. <sighs> Do we want to throw a clarifier? Yeah, we'll throw a clarifier. I am going to use a different deck, though. I'm going to do something I don't normally do. Universe, Source, and Spirit, can I get some clarity on the cards? On the table for my water sign friends for this weekend, please. And a two. And a three. Okay. Why the world and the King of Swords? Seven of Wands, upright, temperance reversed, negative energy flow. 
Someone may have lost patience with the connection. Someone could be having internal struggles, just trying to regain control. Just kind of, yeah. Just wasn't working. Okay. Why the High Priestess reversed and the Four of Pentacles reversed. Oh, could be a Sagittarius you're dealing with. I also have Taurus on the board. Page of Wands reversed. Yeah, someone just decided to let go and not move forward. Yeah, someone just decided to walk away. Not acknowledge the connection anymore. All right. Ace of Cups reversed, Page of Cups reversed. One to clarify, maybe two. Please don't give me any more than two. And what do you do? You give me three. Okay, I'll take three. The Hermit, the King of Swords, and the Two of Swords reversed. Still leading with your head and not your heart. Going inside, doing some inner work this weekend, possibly. And this isn't going to be an easy decision. I see it being a painful one, but I think you, you're, you're being logical. You're doing what you need to do. It, it may be a self-improvement thing. You're just, you're not doing anything about it right now. You're, you're in internalization mode. You're in thought process mode. You're not in emotional mode, and that's okay. Okay, well, do whatever you need to do. All right, let's get your advice. Seven of Pentacles in the upright, King of Wands in the reverse. Be patient. Wait for something prosperous to fruit, and don't jump the gun. You're doing what you need to do. You know what you need to do, water signs. Advice from the other deck. Eight of Swords, Page of Pentacles. Think through any decisions that you're going to make, but don't overthink it. And... Again, don't jump into anything. Make and accept offers when you are ready. Okay? Go slow. There's no need to hit a gas pedal. Not at all. No need for it. Okay. Water signs. There you were, my friends. I hope it resonated. I hope it helps. Now I gotta sort my cards out. Just two seconds. Did I get them all. I think I got them all. I like this witch's tarot deck better than my old one because it's a little bit smaller, so it's an easy clarifier. I'm not mixing up cards and losing cards. I do that a lot. And when I move things to clean under things, I find cards. It's like, oh gosh, what deck did that go to? Because some of my decks have had to replace two or three times because I keep just mysteriously losing cards. It's like they get yeeted into outer space and then outer space regurgitates them. I just found the ball to one of my posts, so I'll put that back on my ear later. Uh, yet another thing that I thought got sucked into the void and there I found it. Wow. All right, fire sign friends, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. What's going on with you guys this weekend? Universe, source, and spirit. Any messages for our fire sign friends, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, for the upcoming weekend? 
page of cups, three of cups reversed. Could be an offer coming in. I don't see you reuniting though. I don't see it. Hmm. Possibly an offer, yeah. Okay, what happened? Six of cups in the upright, page of pentacles in the reverse. Soulmate connection. Probably somebody you've played the game with before. Could be someone you've dealt with before in this life. But things ground to a halt. Okay. Possibly someone you've known from childhood. Okay. What's next? Eight of Wands and the Queen of Pentacles. There was communication. There was very swift movement. You possibly thought you found your catch. Okay. Okay. What's going on this weekend? Queen of Wands reversed. Justice in the reverse. Maybe a Libra you're dealing with. I got a little bit of earth. I got a little bit of fire. I got a little bit of water. The only thing I don't have is air except for this justice card. Okay. No forward movement. No passion for it. Possibly a little bit of imbalance in the connection still. Hmm. Let's get some clarity. All right. Universe, Source, and Spirit are going to get some clarity on the cards on the table for my fire sign friends for this weekend. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. One more. Okay. And a recut. Okay. Why the Six of Cups and the Page of Pentacles reversed? Why this? The world. Ah, uh, end of a cycle. Okay. All right. Somebody maybe came in, did what they were supposed to do, left. It happens. It happens. Cycles close out. Some people are not meant to stay. Why the Eight of Wands and the Queen of Pentacles? Knight of Swords reversed. One more. Fast forward movement. Fast messages. Thought they were the catch. Then a cough and communication. Okay. Either you cut communication off or they did. This world card can also indicate the beginning of a new cycle. Page of Swords reversed. Six of Swords. Mutual cut off in communication. Someone moved on. Okay. Okay. New cycles, things getting cut off. It may have happened very abruptly. Why the Queen of Wands and the reverse and the justice reversed for this weekend for my fire sign friends? Why? Why this? Why this?
Hi! The star! And the justice reversed. Again. Okay. There's imbalance in the relationship. Possibly healing needs to take place. And it could be an Aquarius you're dealing with. Doesn't necessarily have to be. The star is a card of realignment with the universe. Most definitely. It's a card of healing. It's a card of purpose. They may throw that offer out this weekend. I, again, I don't see you taking it. I don't see you in any mood for a reunion right now. You're still healing. They're still in balance. Okay. Let's get your advice. I'm not going to beat a dead horse today. Nine of wands, six of wands, both in the upright. One last push to victory? What? One last push to victory? Ah, okay. Okay. No. Chariot, four of wands reversed. This splits the story a little bit. For some of you, one last push to victory. For some of you, forward movement, close the door behind you. Put the distance there. So four of these together, you need to collect yourself. You need to get through the battle. You're still in the battle, you're still healing. Keep your walls up, maintain your distance. Move forward to that victory after the battle and let the dust settle. Maybe when the dust settles, balance will return. Okay, let's see what this deck has to say. The nine of wands in the upright and the queen, the king of wands in the reverse. The Ace of Wands and the Nine of Cups. Okay. I think you're defending your heart right now. Don't be abrasive when you do that. So if this person who tries to return this weekend... It's saying maintain your walls, most definitely, but don't be abrasive. There is something new coming for you, and there's something new coming for you that will be emotionally fulfilling. A restart in passion. So when you're ready and you've processed this, Happiness is on its way, fire signs. That's amazing. Just keep in mind, people come, people go. And it's Mercury retrograde, so a lot of people are going to be coming back. It's up to you what you do with it. If you're not ready, you're not ready. If you want to let it end, let it end. If you want to start it up again, start it up again. It's not my journey. People that you've dealt with in this life come back during retrograde. People you've come back, people you've dealt with in other lives come during retrograde. They come to play again. And they don't always stay. Okay. Earth sign friends. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. 
What do I have for my Earth sign friends this weekend? Universe Source and Spirits. What do the cards have? For my Earth sign friends. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Telling you, I'm gonna get those Encyclopedia Botanics out of storage. I'm gonna bring them home. I'm gonna set them on top of my deck so they're flat again. The lovers reversed. The princess of wands reversed. Unacknowledged connection. No forward movement in regards to an unacknowledged connection. No communication. Once again, nobody's been talking. In the past, we have a three of swords and an ace of pentacles. The ace of pentacles is in the reverse. Heartbreak. No start in abundance. Somebody possibly had to put the house plant on the back deck to see if, you know, it would grow on its own. You weren't playing with it. So you know what? No. No. You broke my heart. You're in the doghouse. Okay. Okay. Fast forward a little bit. The sun... In the upright, the hermit in the reverse. Oh boy. Hmm. The connection's still there. The connection's still there. Someone may have had their head in the sand about it a little bit. Well, the hermit in the reverse is not a card of self reflection, it, it, it's a card of flat out ignoring everything. <laughs> You're not reflecting on anything. You're just, you know, in a box. Not dealing with it. Mm. Not necessarily okay. But if it's how you roll, it's how you roll. It's the meh card. Meh. You're on the back deck. I'm not dealing with you. But you still feel the connection. But you're not acknowledging it. Next. This weekend... Strength in the upright. Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Ooh, that's, the, that's a shaky step on the path. But at least I see you acknowledging the connection. I'm going to throw a clarifier on that. The polarities of a connection... Universe's source and spirit. What do the cards have for my earth sign friends this weekend? A little clarity on the cards for my earth sign friends for this weekend. Why the Three of Swords and the Ace of Pentacles reversed? Why this? Bad time for that. Thank you. Page of Pentacles reversed. Hmm. Something ground to a halt. Possibly an apology that was never given. We're not accepted. Take it however it resonates. Why the sun upright, the hermit reversed? Of 
two swords reversed. <laughs> Connection's still there. You're ignoring it, just trying to make it go away. If I ignore the pain long enough, I'm not going to feel it anymore. Okay. That's how you roll. That's how you roll. It's very much a fire sign thing. I, 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 I don't often hear... Well, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Earth signs are pretty good at the meh. Whatever. That's why I love you guys. You're so meh. I'm not going to let this affect me. I'm not going to let this stop me from achieving my goal. Meh. It's whatever. You guys are so chill like that. I love it. Very anti-confrontational. I'm just going to ignore this until it goes away. It's a huge Sag thing, too. Huge Sag thing. Sagittarians are amazing at ignoring their emotions. I should know. Okay. We were talking about earth signs. Why strength? Why strength? Why strength? Page of Wands reversed. Knight of Cups reversed. You're harnessing your strength this weekend. I think you're going to finally tell somebody to take a long walk up short pier. Make dust. You are not giving or receiving. You are not giving or receiving. Don't talk to me. You're not moving forward with this. You're not accepting a cup. You're not giving a cup. You are staying strong and grounded. And planted like a tree. <laughs> nice. I like it. Why the Ten of Pentacles reversed? Oh, Eight of Swords. Page of Wands reverse shot up twice, by the way. The Princess is a page. Thought I'd throw that out there. Could be a fire sign you're dealing with. Could be a Gemini. Could be a Virgo. Could be a Leo. I got two Leo cards, so if that's setting off alarms in your head, you know. Whoever keeps track of that. It's the energies coming off the cards, too. Could be people, could be energies. Can I get one more on the Ten of Pentacles reversed, please? For my Earth sign friends, thank you! Seven of Wands. Woo. Your head may not be in the game this weekend. I mean, you're staying grounded. You're 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 firm. You're standing firm. I ain't dealing with it. Mm. I want no part of it. I ain't talking to you. Mm. But it's still affecting your emotional and mental state. You're still very much in your head about it. It may be causing some inner voices or inner demons to be stirring too. One more on that. Oh. Oh. Eight of Cups came right out. Walking away painfully. Well. Hmm. Okay. It's up to you what you do with that. Let's get your advice. Hereford reversed. Nine of Swords reversed. This connection was meant to teach you something, but you're not supposed to overthink it this weekend. Just come out of your head about it. In time, the lesson will come. In time. Don't 
you think? Meh. Just be like meh. Five of Pentacles reversed and the Fool reversed. They come back, trying to come back out of the cold. Don't jump. You're meant for a different path, my Earth sign friends. The Fool reversed came back out and the Moon reversed came back out. Don't overthink it. Things will be illuminated in their own time. Don't jump. You are meant for a different path. The lovers in the upright and the strength in the reverse. Hmm. Yes, this was a powerful soulmate connection. Yes, you still feel it. But stand your ground. Stand your ground. That's what the cards have to say, my earth sign friends. Okay. Air signs. I wasn't there. Don't ask. I wasn't there. It's not my journey. It's yours. I wasn't there. I wasn't there. Doggone it, if they're going to come back and play, they're going to come back and play right with you. They're going to play straight with you. Stand your ground. All right, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, what's going on for you guys this weekend? My air sign friends, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. to come out and play. The sun in the reverse. The page of cups. Hmm. On a dollar's connection, possibly. Could be a Leo you're dealing with. Possible messages coming in this weekend. You might just be a little bit down in the dumps, but you got messages coming in this weekend. You could be giving, you could be receiving. It's going to be possibly a cute little text or phone call. All right. Hermit reversed in the Page of Wands. Could have been a Virgo you were dealing with. More of that ignoring one's feelings or ignoring the situation, just moving on anyway. Tell you roll, tell you roll. Hmm. Tell you roll, tell you roll. But just remember, a little lizard. The cat saying, "Let's go, let's go," and the little lizard like, "I'm the little lizard of whatever you're not dealing with. I'm gonna interrupt your path." Hmm. You know what that says to me? Eventually, you have to deal with it. Eight of Cups reversed, Nine of Cups. A return that brought great joy. We'll get clarifier on that in a minute. Hmm. What's going on this weekend? Judgment and the Four of Wands. End of a cycle. Or a cycle nearing completion. Something finally dying and being reborn. Oh, wow. 
that's celebration, that's stability, that's doors opening. Universe, source, and spirit, can I get some clarity on the cards and the table for my air sign friends, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, for this weekend? Just so everyone's aware, I am recording this on Friday. You may not see it until Saturday because by the time I get done with this, um, I have to hurry up and go to my bread and butter job. And it takes probably a good hour for YouTube to review it. <laughs> so I have slow internet and then they have to review it. So that's okay. You will receive the message when you are meant to receive it. I cannot control that. And it's Mercury retrograde, so I'm sure stuff's breaking everywhere. Mm. Why the Hermit reversed page wands? Whoa! Seven of Cups reversed. Confusion. Emotions being all mixed up. Not dealing with things. You know, eventually, if you don't deal with it, it's going to come back to haunt you. Why the Eight of Cups reversed? Okay, if you insist. Queen of Cups. Someone or something that you held very dear came back. Brought your emotional fulfillment. Why the Nine of Cups? Five of Wands, Eight of Wands reversed, Page of Wands, Page of Wands. Oh my. You're happy. You're content. Things are moving forward. There's a cutoff in communication. There's a lack of forward movement. There is confrontation. That's a series of events. Were you really happy? Did you just think you were happy? Were you one cup away from happy and then someone kicked your last cup over? Someone yanked a cup away? There's the cup right there. I think someone may have wanted to move a little bit faster than the other. Led to a confrontation. We're good. I want more. Led to a confrontation. Yeah, I'm doing it this way. Why judgment? Why judgment? Why judgment? Five of Pentacles reverse. Somebody trying to come back in out of the cold. Very impatiently. Seven of Pentacles reverse. Someone not biding their time. Someone possibly beating on the door. I want back in! You have to, may have to make a judgment call on this. And I think you do. Page of Cups reversed. It's going to come in. I think you're going to be like, you know what? You kicked my cup over. I don't want your cup. I don't want the cup that you're going to try to reuse 
to replace the cup that I had in my hand that you knocked over. I don't want your cup. Take a long walk off short pair. Make dust. I don't want it. Why the four of wands? Why the four of wands? Why the four of wands? Why this? Why this? My thumb knocked those out. That didn't happen naturally. That happened naturally, though. Ace Cups. I think a new cup for you to get back to emotional fulfillment's coming. I think a door's going to open once you slam this one shut. That's amazing, my friends. That's something to celebrate. I like it. I'm happy for you. Let's get your advice. Three of swords reversed, double reversed. You got to come out of that state of heartbreak. You got to disconnect from whatever obsessive toxic things were weighing you down. You got to take off the cement shoes, my friends. Justice in the reverse, ten of wands in the reverse. You have to release the burden and end the cycle and allow the, re the death, resurrection, and rebirth of judgment to bring it back into balance because right now it's not. You have to turn these two back up into the upright. The only one with the power to do that is you. Just remember that. You are in charge of your own damn destiny. Nobody else's. You cannot rely on other people for your emotional fulfillment. You have to find it within yourself. This Ace of Cups, maybe self-love. That's justice right there. Ten of Wands in the upright, High Priestess in the reverse. Got to close this cycle out. Page of Swords, upright, Ten of Swords in the reverse. Mm. That's interesting. Oh, wow. Definitely. I'm going to lay it at the feet of the universe, my friends. Only you can do that. And don't let other people whisper in your ear that you could potentially be doing the wrong thing. And don't sit there and dwell. Again, you are the only one with the power to end this cycle. You are the only one with the power to allow the sun to shine again in your life. It's all up to you. It is your path, not mine. I just read the cards. Okay, friends. Thanks for coming by. I appreciate you all wholeheartedly. July readings are still coming out. I... I don't know how many of you watch Sagittarius reading. I'm going through some stuff physically, emotionally, mentally. I'm struggling energetically. I'm getting the cards out as fast as I can. I'm not going to force reads to get content up. I'm not going to do it. Because that's not fair to you guys. The connection with universe, source, and spirit has to be the strongest. And it's not the strongest if my head and heart aren't it. So, I love you guys. Thanks for coming by. Be blessed. Be good to yourselves this weekend. I'll catch you guys at the very latest for the work week top and bottom, Sunday night or Monday morning. All right. Love ya. Catch you next time.